<laughs> oh my God, this is posh. <laughs> Look at you all in your good clothes because the telly's here and there's lights on you. Go on, oh, I better get a suit next. <laughs> Oh my God, it's brilliant, isn't it? I love Scottish people, I love it. I mean, and I, and I love the fact, you know, there's not any real royalty in this town, so you just get people from House and the Tates just to sit in the boxes up there, which is great. <laughs> there's a couple of builders and the missus over there and a couple of electricians in those boxes over there. <laughs> just go, <"All> right. <laughs> How the name of God did you get in that box over there? <laughs> Are you working in that box? <laughs> Doing a bit of plastering. Oh, hey, oh, hey. That's right, great. Right. 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 Oh, I'll better stay. I'll just show on. Great. I'll ring the missus. Hey. <laughs> oh, I'm not having a poo. I'm going to get back up. Sorry. <laughs> and I love Scottish people because you're miserable. It's brilliant, you know. It's brilliant because, you know, like, I, I, was, I, I was in Australia before I came here. Three and a half months. Where, where are the Australians? Are cheer down there? Yeah, well done, the Australians. Always near the front, the Australians, in every show in Edinburgh. So they can get near the natural light of the stage. <laughs> oh, I've got to get near the light. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. All <laughs> oh, the Scottish and Irish up in the dark, in the damp, in the roof. Oh, this is all right. I'll stay here. I'm not going down the front. It might make me happy. Yeah. <laughs> it's just great, the misery of the Scots. They're great. Your hearts beat twice a year. It's brilliant, you know. Just poof. What the hell was that? <laughs> oh, I'm blue. <laughs> and it's great. Like, even your breakfast is miserable. There's nothing happy about breakfast. What do you want for breakfast? Porridge! <laughs> What, what, what with your porridge? A little bit of sugar? No, salt! I want to die! <laughs> People crawling along to work with no energy whatsoever. <laughs> oh my God, somebody help us for Christ's sake. <laughs> we need money into this city. <laughs> I know, what can we do? I don't know, I know. Let's do the tattoo. <laughs> Let's trick loads of old people and bring them to this thing called a tattoo. They must have rang up Michael Flatley to get the idea off him, right? Just loads of people doing the same shit at the same time. <laughs> There's nothing more terrifying when those buses arrive into Edinburgh with tons of old people just being poured off. <laughs> it's like a zombie movie as we all head up to the castle. We're here to see the marching soldiers. <laughs> Where's the marching soldiers? Oh my God, I love this city, it's amazing. Can you tell me where the castle is, please? <laughs> what, you mean that thing on the hill up there? <laughs> Unbelievable. And then they go in, right? And the, cause the I love the tattoo because it's such a scam, isn't it? There's loads of army people just going this way. Just go this way, just go this way. <laughs> Quick, the watch it change. Okay, let's go this way, go this way. Let's go this way, quick, let's go this way. Quick, back up, back up. Okay, let's go this way, quick. quick. Bring a cannon out, bring a cannon out. Lights, fireworks. Wow, never seen them before. Yes, I have, right? There's nothing more terrifying for old people. I mean, what a way to get rid of old people, to send them to the tattoo. Because that last bit is totally terrifying. And they're all sitting there with their blankets all together, and the tattoo ends. <laughs> <sighs> oh my God, Siobhan. What's wrong? Mary's dead. <laughs> Quick, take her blanket. <laughs> and her biscuits. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen. I'm very sorry for upsetting your culture. <laughs> but I'm Irish and that's my job. I've been Jason Byrne. Enjoy the rest of the marathon!